Well, bringing you an oldie. An old game. I don't even know when I... Well, I don't know at the end when I see the results when I freaking play this, but it is definitely old. <laughs> BK45. You know what's crazy how tiny that... This, this heavy tank, this, this is considered a super... I would consider this a super heavy tank. I mean, compared to like the E75, this does has some pretty thick armor, but it's tiny. Look how small I am. I'm like the size of a medium tank. Look at the hard case is freaking bigger than me. I mean, I prefer out of the three German tier nine heavies, I prefer the E75. It's more well-rounded. But this... Oof. I'd say this is better than the Maushin. This is really good at side-scraping. Compared to the Maushin. Because the Maushin has all the freaking... I give it a bunch of weak spots. <laughs> yeah, oh man. Look, look at how nice this game looks. I mean... <laughs> Uh, I miss old World Tanks where they did the freaking Cold War update. To me, this looks a lot better. Now, I probably should. I have like a whole bunch of old videos I I need to commentate on and upload. Yeah, the VK-45, which is the rear-mounted version of the Tier 8 version. I think there's also a Tier 7 version, which is basically a, <laughs> a middle-mounted turret. It's, it's basically just a, a Tiger, the Tier 7 version. It's, I mean, it's like a, a Tiger 2, but with, you know... Tiger 1 stats, pretty much. I'm actually surprised that there is nobody coming down here. You know, it's crazy. I don't come down here anymore. Gosh, how this game has changed. Look at me trying to figure out what, what the hell's going on. Of course, you can see. Man, even back... There's, like, hardly ever... That many, uh... PS4 players. There's always tons of Xbox players. And I guess it's probably because, I mean, this came out on Xbox first. Ooh. Oh. Hands, hands there. Oh, no. E75. As you can see, there is also an enemy tank behind me, but... I'm like, you know what? I'll come up here and deal with him first. Maybe. Oh. I guess it's when I noticed that there's, oh, there's an enemy behind me. Oh, here he comes. Now, come on, use your speed and mobility to beat me, E75. Come on. You're not tiny. I, I'm so small compared to him, but I have better armor. <laughs> I don't. I don't understand. It, I guess it's kind of the same way with the the ST1 and the IS4. Oh. You can see though, there's something coming up behind me. Oh, there's a corpse of my teammate there. This poor E75 can't seem to hit me. Yeah, but I already know. Here they come. Conqueror. Ah, unfortunately, I only take off his tracks. I asked you for that heavy. You see that heavy to the right? I want him to come over here and help me out.
Oh, there we go. They're aiming at my cupola. That's not good. Begging that conqueror to come over and help me. See, I, I remember this. this is, I was so annoyed. I'm like, ah, man, I hate this. I, I'd rather be off doing some other stuff than fighting these two guys. Hey, conqueror, come over here and fight this other conqueror. Two v one isn't very fun. I don't know what was up with that conqueror. I don't know where he went. I guess he decided to go off and fight our conqueror. See how nice the the enemy conqueror knew what to do. I don't know what's up with our conqueror. Okay. I'm a little bit worried because he is a medium tank. You can flank around. Of course, since it is Object 430 version 2, he can't turn his turret backwards. Of course, you're know, shooting gold at me, because, you know, that's what you do. Instead of using your mobility to get around my flank. Uh, now you decided to do it, but it's a little bit too late. I'm I'm actually surprised he tried to shoot at my cupola. He should have just shot at the side of my tank. There we go. Finally. I can get out of this ravine. You know, I actually bought back my ST1. I should probably buy back my E75 to see if I can actually get three marks on them. Because I mean, I already got three marks on my M103. Of course, it's probably going to be hella difficult now because the game's probably accounting for people on the on the PS4. Or, you know, PlayStation. And on Xbox. I bet they have World Tanks on the PS5, right? But I really wish they'd bring back this. Uh, it looks a lot... To me, the UI looks a lot better. And I like the the reticle um, stands out a lot more. For some reason, I'm not at all far. I I can see just fine, but for some reason, I have trouble seeing the reticle for the the Cold War version of World Tanks. It bugs the crap out of me. Maybe I am getting too old for this game. It's just an excuse because I've been doing so bad. Poor last enemy tank trying to cap us out. And you know what's nice too? Look, it shows you all the. Did You had 19 shots, you killed 4 enemies, 2 spot damage, 10 critical. Ah. They don't show the ribbons anymore. Let's see, when was this re when, when did I play this? 2020. 723. I guess it really has been a... Been... Pretty much a year since they uh, updated it. 
I think pretty much. Man, I want to go back to this. 